she's managed to get it just to the point. <laughs> yeah. Off. yeah. Yeah, give the air brakes a give the air brakes a try. Give, that. Oh. give it a good yank. It's strong. Go on. Pull it back like this. Like this. Yeah? Go on. Pull it back. Yeah. So that will basically be what you're using to, as you land. Okay, and then everything else. So when this blade is long, it will all go. But everything else in here. Is there anything you recognize here? In terms of instrumentation? That's all speed. Yeah, speed, good. And now we're at the top. That's the altitude. Okay, uh, yeah, this is altitude here. Uh, what do you reckon this is? And that's the angle. It's very ominous, so it tells you if you're going up or down. Okay. This one's a chronic one, it makes a beeping sound if you're going up or down. Um, and also, just to be, just for the wild people, we've got the G meter here. So actually, it'll actually sort of go up to about 6 G this thing. So if, you, if you're flying it a bit crazy. Um, White handles fully forward. Come on, please. Thanks. Yeah, launch flight, we're just about to do a launch. Accelerations fairly quickly on mm -hmm. this. I don't know if you've seen the other winch launches. Yeah. Today, yeah. Thank you. 
was that? Yeah. Just to like glide up there and just up and out. Right there, yeah. yeah. Oof, that was that was a lot more fighter jet. Variometer there, it's the top right instrument. Yeah, it's the volume knob. Yeah, you just turn that up a bit. So, yeah, the other one, the one that says volume on the right hand side of it. Oh, where? Where it says vol. I oh, hear top right instrument. This one, right? No, up top right. Oh, top right. Yeah. Is this hard? Don't worry. Yeah, I don't know. Yeah. Very up there to the left. Very a lot, a lot higher than us. Um, Turning? Uh, not really. Okay, I'll stop. <laughs> That's just the problem if you're not used to it. Um, it's wider above us, obviously. You see, it's just gone to our right, it's not behind us. Yeah. Put your right hand on the stick and just feel what I'm doing. Just okay, 
they are, if not the same. Yeah, right. You know this area, in there? Um, yeah. Not really. Other than those, you've got fronting for. Yeah. Just to the right is Leicester in the distance. Uh, there's North Kilworth Marina just down there. Um, uh, the Husband's Bosworth, pretty much. Uh, Welford's Village, the next one. Uh, over in the distance now, you've got Northampton. Over the nose in the distance. Market Harbour is just coming onto the nose now.
buttons. Okay, if you like to put your right hand on the stick and just follow through with me. I'll show you how the controls work. First is the elevator. Do you remember I mentioned the attitude, the view over the front of the cockpit? It's not changing, is it? Yeah. Uh, so if I gently move the stick forward, the nose goes down, more ground's in view, and the speed's increasing. If I gently ease the stick back, Disappearing from view, we're slowing down, we're in a different attitude. Just lower the nose back to the normal attitude around there. Would you like to try that? Uh, not so. Yeah, don't worry, you're not going to do anything wrong, that can't sort out. Right. You have control, just yeah. gently move the stick forward, just remember small movements. Move the stick back then. You see, it's only small movements you need to change yeah. that, that picture in front of you. Yeah. Okay, just follow through with me. Uh, you notice the view ahead. This is what the view looks like just normal flight. If we were turning, the view would look like this, which we've obviously seen already. But, uh, Okay, turn the glider. I'm gonna, if you look round to the right as far as you can, or the right, no. and if you see anything, tell me. You'll be turning your head a lot more, so you start sitting behind the wing and look back over the nose. Now I'm going to move the stick to the right, the right wing goes down, continues going down, so I'll move the stick back to the centre and use a little bit of backwards pressure on the stick. To come out, so the glider's bank, therefore we turn. To come out, we turn, I look out to the left, make sure it's clear, then look back over the nose, move the stick left. As the wings come level, I centralise the stick and relax that back pressure. Would you like to try to get the upper control? Look, we'll go to the left first. So look out to the left. If you see anything, tell me. On the left. <laughs> That's it. Then look over the nose again and move the stick left. Good. Uh, so a little bit of back pressure on the stick as the speed increasing, move the stick left a little, no right, I mean, so. Turn to the left, so I've looked out, it looks clear to our right, I look back over the nose, move the stick right, a little bit of back pressure. You see the difference to what when you try to turn? Yeah. You just you don't quite get it right, which most people don't start with. It just takes yeah, practice and getting comfortable. So your first flight, you're probably still getting used to the new sensations. Have control. If you want to try to turn to the left again, look out first to the left, then look over the nose and move the stick left. Yeah. Alright. Try to turn to the left. And then. Yeah, I'm 
going to line up and we'll sort of head back to land.
Okay. Leave it there. 